All right, Python hunters, get ready. Registration's now open for the Python Challenge. You going out there? No. Yeah, yeah no. <laughs> All right, the competition is happening, though, this summer and has a big, big prize. Local 10 News reporter Annalise Garcia is live. She's in Homestead, where the lieutenant governor uh, just made a big announcement out there. What's that announcement, Annalise? Hey, Christy Janice, so that's the Florida Python Challenge. It's starting now in August, but today registration opens. They actually came out here and did an entire demonstration on how to catch these things. They actually offered at the end of that demonstration for anyone to come over and take a photo with it, touch the python. I opted out of it. I am not a snake gal, so I did not go in to take any photos, but we certainly got plenty of video for you. Uh, the biggest prize here for this Florida Python Challenge is $10,000. The Burmese python, as many of you know, is an invasive species that has wreaked havoc on our Everglades ecosystem, and it's a threat to the native wildlife. The 11th year of the Florida Python Challenge. Registration is officially open. The competition runs for 10 days from August 9th to the 19th, and it's all about catching snakes. Last year, over 200 pythons were removed from the Everglades and almost 1,050 people participated. Professional and novice participants are invited to compete to remove pythons from the Everglades. An animal that can get 200 pounds and 20 feet long, absolutely destroying the natural food chain of the Everglades. Thursday, one pro did a demonstration on how to capture these snakes. Like you, mm -hmm. <laughs> this one right here, a 10 foot long female python. The snake is most comfortable on the ground. Once you start lifting the snake is when it starts to react. The demonstrator released her. So a big thing when catching snakes is to remember there is no rush. She didn't like him very much, but eventually he caught her. Just like that, reach in. There are prizes for the longest snake caught and also for whoever catches the most. This challenge will allow the public to engage directly and in a hands-on way in Everglades restoration. And uh, I'm happy to announce also that participants will be able to win prizes and of course do us a tremendous public service. So again, the biggest prize here is $10,000. Then after that, there's a few more for $5,000. So some pretty nice prizes there. Uh, registration is open today. You just have to go to flpythonchallenge.org and you can sign up there. There's also an online uh, thing that you have to do before signing up. So just make sure you check out all the details on that website. Again, some pretty decent sized prizes. I did not touch a snake today. I will certainly not be participating in this challenge. <laughs> we are live in the Everglades. Annalise Garcia, Local 10 News. Uh, it's okay, we don't Annalise. Blame you. We, we are right there with you. We're, we're not, we're, we're not snake, snake girls either. No, no, but you know what? <laughs> Janine Stanwood knows how to catch a python. She's, She's fearless. It. Good for her. Yeah, <laughs> she, we'll, let, we'll send her. We'll send her out there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, thank you for, the, uh, for bringing us that story, Annalise. Uh, let's turn